One teacher and her pen. Welcome back for day four. Today we're going to go for a shape and space thing. So if you have a look at this diagram, how many triangles of any size are there? So you could have any size triangles. I want you to count up and see how many there are. So pause the video while you have a go and then unpause to find out the answer. So, did you get the answer of 12? I hope you did. So there are four this size, the little ones here, so we've got four of those. You've got two, which are this size, there and there, so that's another two. Okay, we've got two, which are this size, one that side and one the other side, so that's another two. And then the last ones we've got are these right angled triangles one and then we've got two and then we'll have them upside down as well so three that way and four so we've got another four as well so four add two add four add two is our answer of 12. now this is for big boys and girls so this is question two today what is the angle x so I'm hoping you remember your angle facts and you've got to think about all the different things you know about angles and see if you can actually work out what angle X is. So give the video a pause, try and do your working out and then come back for the answer. Okay, so a quick lesson in angles. Angles that meet on a straight line add up to 180. We've got angles around a point add up to 360. Angles inside a triangle add up to 180. And angles in a four-sided shape add up to 360 degrees. This is the one that we're going to use here. Look, angles in a four-sided shape, so one, two, three, Four would have to add up to 360 degrees. So if I've got 360 and I'm going to take away 15, take away 25 and take away 35, I'm going to get my answer. And this answer leaves you with 285. So I now know that this angle here inside must equal 285 degrees. And what was the other angle fact we knew? Angles around a whole point add up to 360 degrees. So if all of these are 360 degrees, 360 degrees and take away 285 leaves me with 75 degrees. So well done if you've got your answer of 75 degrees. You can't always rely on the picture. Can't always say, oh, well, that looks more than 90, because sometimes pictures are not drawn to scale. So the answer to X is 75 degrees. And one last little problem for you today. The diagram shows the net of a cube. So you've got to remember what a net is, an unfolded shape. So which edge, when it's all folded up, would meet with X? So the diagram shows the net of a cube. Which edge meets the edge X when the net is folded to form the cube? You guessed it. I'm not going to give you the answer until tomorrow. See you tomorrow.